Hello, in this video I'll be showing off a foldable keyboard that I uh, bought from online and it comes with different specifications and such and it's a Bluetooth keyboard it uses a uh, Bluetooth uh, 3.0 and it uses a micro USB uh, um, port for charging I'll go ahead and open it up and show you what's inside So this is the uh, keyboard itself. It feels um, has a texture similar to that you'd feel on a wallet, but it's not leather. It's some. Uh, it's uh, I bet it's some uh, something made of plastic, but it doesn't feel like plastic. And this is how it looks. It has quite a unique design in my opinion because usually many keyboards come out straight. And the logic to the uh, shape of this keyboard is that, you, you know, people don't um, um, use their hands straight like this. Like if you ergonomically, what's more comfortable is to keep um, two hands on either side slightly bent because that's how the, our uh, hands are designed, our arms. And so this is indeed uh, more ergonomic than typing like this with a different type of keyboard. And the keycaps are actually quite sturdy I don't think uh, they would uh, break off so easily I had a I bought it a while back a different Bluetooth keyboard which isn't as good a long time ago I bought this to, uh, on Bluetooth keyboard and although I like it it's uh, slow to type on it's not very it's a uh, very stiff and the keycaps break off quite easily it's one of these keycaps you can see um, that it broke off easily because of what it was made of. Anyways, this one feels a lot more um, sturdy. The keycaps feel a lot more uh, sturdy and feel like they're attached and they won't come off as easily. And they're a lot easier to press. And they're not stiff. They're sufficiently, um, I suppose you can say, say they're sufficiently stiff so there's nice uh, tactile feedback. Uh, when you click them, so I would uh, describe that as maybe resistance or just uh, how, how springy they feel, which is good for uh, replicating a tactile feeling that you'd find with like may maybe a mechanical keyboard. Of course, this is not a mechanical keyboard, but otherwise, I really like this um, keyboard. I like how um, the shape and design, so you can literally just put it in your pocket. I don't know if you can see, but I should be able to just put it in my pocket like that see like that see it's just in my pocket so it's a very it's um, very compact for a keyboard I really like that and you can just carry it out, carry it down or uh, carry it around wherever you want this is the micro USB charging port you'd uh, need to use for charging this and there's also a magnet over here because these automatically uh, go together if you uh, allow them to see see so there is a magnet here that helps keep this uh, together which is quite uh, you know ingenious and I uh, believe that there would be a is there not a wire that's there should be like a wire in between connecting this to this um, halves of the keyboard but you know it's not apparent and yeah I really like this keyboard it's uh, made of solid uh, plastic, like maybe ABS plastic, or something like that. And um, it just it's just a really nice keyboard. The texture here is almost uh, to that of a wallet, although it's made of plastic. And now the only thing I need to do is test typing with this keyboard. And you can hear what it sounds like to type on. It looks like uh, there's all the important keys that you would need for a keyboard. There's the Windows key, the FN key, so you can switch and choose one of these blue, uh, blue colored uh, 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 functions. For example, for uh, for escape, you'd press function and then escape like that. You see, and there, there is let's see, you know, all these other options. They have the compressed uh, keys for up, down, left, and right. 
as well as uh, putting um page up page down home and end over here and yeah it just looks like it has all the keys that you would need mm, quite surprisingly so uh and this is the bluetooth icon i think maybe you'd need that for pairing so right now you might notice a difference in camera quality because right now i'm shooting with my lumia 1020 um nokia phone and this is my uh note 9 phone it has a better uh, video camera or camera for taking video but you know for the sake of demonstration i'll show you how i paired this bluetooth keyboard with my note 9 phone so the first thing you want to do is make sure that you turn off this keyboard which you can do by closing it and you can turn on the keyboard by simply or opening it the next thing you want to do is uh, i probably need to go to um, bluetooth options like so so under the Bluetooth options, there is a couple of uh, things over here for me to use, but I don't see the Bluetooth foldable keyboard. So what you do is go ahead, press the FN, and the um, if you can see that, there is a Bluetooth icon where the T is. So the FN and the Bluetooth icon. And now this should start blinking blue. So that means it's uh, now in pairing mode. And now I need to uh, see if that keyboard comes up over here. And it should. And then the next thing you need to do is a scan to see if you can uh, find what, of, what other devices are available, uh, what, which devices are pairing. So that's the next thing you need to do. And this is the Bluetooth keyboard that we are looking for. See? I'll go ahead and select that. And now it's pairing. And now it has paired. The next thing I need to do is go um, go to the home. I'm going to go to Word. And I'll just uh, type a Word document. Give me a second. So I'll make a new document. I'll choose a blank document. And I'll start uh, typing for you. See, it works just fine, but I should probably um, use it in this mode. Hello, everyone. It gets a little uh, getting used to because usually you expect the keyboard to be straight. So I, I definitely uh, noticed that, you know, that a different angle is uh, doesn't feel the same. Hello everyone, how are you today? Oh, this feels weird. Are you doing fine? Are you doing fine? That is definitely a different uh, way of typing. Not like this, but like this. And it definitely feels different. So, um, are you doing fine? I hope so. So far, far I like this. Bluetooth uh, keyboard, although although I am uh, let's see, I am not used to typing at this angle. Perhaps, uh, perhaps with time, I will will get used to typing at this odd but ported ported ergonomic angle huh it does feel quite interesting and see, as you can see, it has uh, synced quite nicely. So thank you for listening. If you have any questions, please feel free to ask me in the comments below. I'd appreciate if you like and share this video and subscri I mean, subscribe to my channel. If you have any uh, questions about the um, keyboard, feel free to ask me in the comments below. Yeah, thank you and bye.